body. Did you guys see Winnie? I was like looking for her because they told me she came. But like, I haven't seen her. And I miss her. I want to say hi to her. But the I've missed you so I much. I miss friend. you, my friend. Friend. How are you doing, my friend? I'm good, friend. I love you so much, I friend. Love you. Give me a more Oh love, my friend. goodness. Really I love you. It and it feels so good. good. <laughs> I love you. I love you. We used to go play. <gasps> Let's do it. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is awesome. I see them kids. Agape Avenue. We're happy to spend this time with you I see them kids, such a wonderful day To learn what the Bible has to say I'm glad to see all my friends And to know that Jesus' love won't end I see them kids, we're glad you can stay Today's going to be a very awesome day No, I think it's so, so I think it's so crazy that I'm back. It's so fabulous. I know, and I'm back yeah. for good. Oh, like forever? Forever. <gasps> Whoa. That's so amazing, I friend. Know. I can't wait for y'all. Oh. Wow. What was, was that Gordy? That was Gordy. We should go see what's going on. Yeah, well, let's go see. Come on, okay. Gordy. Gordy, what happened? Gordy.
Whoa, 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 <laughs> no, no, don't cough. Take a deep breath. That was disgusting. Okay. It was like in your okay. face too, like that. I okay. know uh, that. I'm scared. What happened? Okay. Why are you scared? Okay, okay. I was taking a nap. Okay. And there was too much light in the room. Okay. okay, yeah, yeah. So Gertie lent me this little eye covering mask thingy to sleep in. Okay. And when I woke up, I couldn't see, and I think I'm gonna die. Oh. Ah! Can I cleanse this? What are you doing? I can't do you it. You have to take off the mask, Gordy! Take off the mask! That's why you cannot see! That's oh. why! Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. There you oh. go. Like Girl, that. You're my hero! Like that. You rescued me! I, I forgot I had that on. Gordy. Yeah. You were a bit a little dramatic. You were a little was, crazy? Yeah, I was well, a little I thought crazy. I was going to die. No, no you just I'm had scared. the mask on your eyes. I had the mask on my eyes. Mm -hmm. yeah, but no. don't you know that like, there's always going to be someone that can help? Yeah, oh, they're going to come save you. Yeah. They're always going to well, they're gonna rescue me? Yeah, rescue? there'll always be oh, someone you rescue you. you girls rescue me. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Uh, do you want to go have some cookies? Oh! I love Ooh, cookies. Whose house are we going to? My house! Oh, oh let's yeah. do it! Let's, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go, let's go! Let's go, let's go! I'm going the wrong way. Okay, go your way. Oh, this okay, way, this okay. way! We're going to go now live on the streets of Agape Avenue with a brand new SWAT reporter, uh, Daniel Ibarra. Danny! Thank you, Archie. Here we are in the streets of Agape Avenue, back at again, asking people what they think about this month's verse. So here we are with Lexi. What do you think about this month's verse? I think this month's verse is just telling us that if God is on our side, why would we be afraid of anything? So she said, if God's on our side, what do you mean by God being on our side? He's with us, like he's on our team, and he's always there for us if we need anything. Thank you so much, Lexi. And this concludes this week's segment of What Does That Verse Mean? Thank you. Hey, are you ready to talk about our verse? Psalms 27.1 The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Today, poor Gordy, he thought he was in trouble. He even thought his life was in danger because he fell asleep with his sleeping mask on. Poor Gordy, he can be a little bit silly. But the Bible does tell us that all of us are in danger. The Bible says, for all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. And we need someone to rescue us. I have here a first aid kit. Now most first aid is designed when someone has a little boo-boo or someone has a little cut, but do you know in most first aid kits there are items that can actually save someone's life? Well, we have another very special first aid kit and his name is Jesus. Jesus is our salvation. Even though our Bible verse was written way before Jesus was born, it was talking about Jesus where it says that he is our salvation. Salvation means we've been saved or rescued. Just like Winnie and Dulce rescued poor Gordy, Jesus came and died on the cross to rescue you and me from our sins. Jesus is the ultimate first aid kit and he loves you so much that he died for you and he came back to life for you so he can be your salvation. We are so happy that you're here with us today. Isn't it great to have them here? 
It was so much fun to have them. I'm so glad that they, they watched us today. We want you to know how valuable you are. They're very, very important to God. Very important. And he loves you so much that he sent his son to die for you. Now, if you're here watching and you've never asked Jesus into your heart, it's very, very important. And it's also kind of easy. Now, I have Pastor Polly here with me, and we're going to show you what you need to do. We're going to say a prayer. And if you will repeat this prayer after me, you're going to ask Jesus into your heart. And he's going to wash away your sins and give you another chance. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to pray. You repeat like Pastor Paula does. You. Are you ready? Let's pray together. You say, Dear Jesus. Dear Jesus. Thank you for loving me. Thank you for loving me. Thank you for coming to earth. Thank you for coming to earth. Dying for me. Dying for me. And coming back to life for me. And coming back to life for me. Now come into my life. Now come into my life. Please forgive me for my sins. Please forgive me for my sins. And send me your Holy Spirit. And send me your Holy Spirit. To help me. To help me. Live for you. Live for you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For giving me another chance. For giving me another chance. And washing away my sin. And washing away my sin. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Now, if you said that prayer, you just asked Jesus into your heart. And you know what? If you did that, give us a message here at ICM Kids Online and let us know that you asked Jesus into your heart. Hi everyone, we are so glad that you are watching our episodes. We love you guys so much and remember, if you're watching us, please make sure to take a picture or a video and tag us at ICM Kids or ICM Laredo. Also, don't forget to hashtag us at ICM Kids. We will be reposting your videos, pictures on Instagram and Facebook. So if you have any ideas they would like to see on Agape Avenue, make sure you comment them on our Instagram and Facebook page and we'll be doing them for you. Bye! See you later! Hasta luego! Farewell! We, we love, love you! you.